What is going on, y'all? This is Arctic Fox. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to look at a case that dates back to 2019. It's a case that's gotten cold and needs some new life injected into it. And honestly, it's a case that never really got the media coverage that it should have, given the circumstances surrounding this one. Um, today, we're going to look at the missing persons case of Vanessa Morales. Vanessa was only 14 months old when she disappeared two years ago from Insonia, Connecticut. And at the time of her disappearance, she was only two feet tall and weighed 17 pounds. She has brown hair and brown eyes, and today she would be three years old. And on your screen, on the flyer, there is an age progressed photo showing what Vanessa may look like today. Vanessa disappeared two years ago, like I said, from Insonia, and she's still missing. And there's currently a $10,000 reward being offered for information leading to finding her. Insonia police responded to the home where Vanessa and her mother lived on the 2nd of December, 2019. They were called there to check on 43-year-old Christine Holloway after she didn't show up for work. And her body was found, and officials said that she had been beaten to death. Vanessa was missing, and so were her belongings. Her car seat was gone, her favorite blanket was gone, her diaper bag was missing. And Sonia police have charged 43-year-old Jose Morales of New Haven with the murder of Christine Holloway. And obviously, they've named Jose as a suspect in the disappearance of Vanessa. But so far, that's it. He hasn't been officially charged with her disappearance. I mean, surely, in this period of time, three years, someone knows something. I firmly believe Jose is responsible for the disappearance of Vanessa. I mean, I think even Stevie Wonder can see that. You know, when he's the one that beat Christine to death, and then the same time, Vanessa just happens to come up missing, it doesn't take a mathematician to put two and two together. But where is Vanessa? Is Vanessa still with us, or did she meet the same fate as her mom? Why did Jose beat his wife to death? Did he do something to Vanessa? Three years is a long time for this little girl to be missing. And we need answers. Vanessa deserves justice one way or the other. Whether she's still here with us and Jose's keeping her captive somewhere... Or whether, unfortunately, Jose did something to where Vanessa is no longer with us. Either way, we need to find out. This little girl deserves justice. This little girl deserves a voice. And as far as I'm aware, there's not even been an Amber Alert put out for this little girl. If any girl deserves one, it is Vanessa. So we're going to have to be her Amber Alert. We're going to have to get her face out on social media. We're going to have to demand justice for Vanessa. Do me a favor, guys. Help me out here. Number one, if you have any information, no tip is too small, guys. I don't care if you think it's insignificant or not. You make that call. If you know something, say something. If you've seen something, say something. If you have information about... Vanessa's disappearance, you need to contact the Ansonia Police Department at 203-735-1885, or you can contact the FBI at 203-503-5555. Guys, I need you to give this video a like. It does help more people to see Vanessa's face, and obviously, the more people that see her, the better the chances that we can find out what happened to Vanessa and bring her justice. Also, if you're not subscribed to the channel yet, please consider clicking that red subscribe button. It really helps me out. And if you ring that notification bell, you'll always be alerted when I post another missing persons video. But the most important thing, 
that I need for all of you to do right now is to simply click that share button. Share this to your Facebook, your Twitter, your Instagram, wherever you have social media. Guys, it only takes a second of your time to do, but it can make all the difference in the world and whether we're able to bring justice for Vanessa or not. As always, guys, I do thank you so much for tuning in and watching. I appreciate each and every single one of you. Y'all be kind to one another out there, and let's find out what happened to Vanessa.